It's been a little under three months since the passing of Virginia's 4th District Congressman, Democrat Donald McEachin. He was re-elected for his fourth term just weeks before he died. His family shared he passed after a years-long battle with complications from colorectal cancer. On Tuesday, State Senator Jennifer McClellan will face Leon Benjamin and a special election to fill the congressional seat. Both candidates have a busy weekend making their final push to connect with voters. Democrat Jennifer McClellan spent Saturday going door to door of homes and businesses with labor leaders, community members, and lawmakers like Senator Tim Kaine. I'm just very excited. There's a lot of enthusiasm and people are just ready to make history. If elected, McClellan will be the first black woman to represent Virginia in Congress. In December, she overwhelmingly won the Democrat Firehouse primary. She is a corporate attorney and has been a Virginia lawmaker since 2006. She plans to advocate for voting rights, access to health care, education, addressing climate change, and creating jobs. So I I got interested in government because I understood at a young age that it can be a powerful force for change and helping people um, and I've spent my life doing that and I'm ready to do it on a bigger level and help more people. Republican Leon Benjamin also spent Saturday door knocking with community members as well as holding a get out the vote rally Saturday night. I'm feeling great and uh, this is what it's all about, you know, seeing the change uh, and the potential to see a whole community come together. Benjamin is a pastor and Navy veteran. He has challenged McEachin in the role unsuccessfully twice. He wants to bring hope to the community that he can instill change. Benjamin says if elected, he would focus on education, crime, curtailing government spending, and job creation. It's about us being humans again. We all bleed the same blood. So when they look at me, they, they should see the people's choice. They should see freedom. They should see unity. They should see faith. They should see, see love. Early voting for this race is now closed. You can cast your vote for this special election on Tuesday between 6 a.m. and 7 p.m.